Got a real doozy here for you today. You have the new pen gobble, which gains extra mana whenever it gets mana. Naturally, you got to pair with the rock. And we figure, okay, what's the best mana pet? Chimera. So you put a Chimera with a Kitsune behind it. You throw a rock pen gobble in the front and it just goes insane. It's too strong perhaps, but it should be a good time. Hope you enjoy it. We're on the test server, by the way. These are all test server changes so far. So still time for things to adjust. Let's jump right in. Oh, and also this weekend, we're going to have two streams, one in the morning, one in the afternoon on Saturday. You got to be there. We're going to play each of the four packs, two on the first stream, two on the next, not turtle pack. And whoever wins the viewer lobby gets a pack of their choosing. So the winner of each of these games will be the winner of a brand new clean, hot off the press pack. Whatever one you want should be a good time. Get yourself a pack. And that is again this Saturday, one in the morning, one in the afternoon for maximum availability wherever you are in the world. Hope to see you there. Sneaky egg, not bad. Run a little Alchemedes, little Bunyip, see what happens. What do we want? Overexcited beams, pants, pronks. I don't know. I don't think I don't think pronk is a word. I'm like pretty sure it's not. Ninety-nine percent sure. I could picture it in some sort of like I don't know Victorian era something like way back when there was probably a pronk at some point. But it, it most likely doesn't mean what it used to, if it does exist. Okay. That is fine. That's alright. We'll take the draw. Let's get a level on our pen gobble. A lucky cat. A natural fit with the Oga Pogo. I think we could try it. Uh, these all kind of suck a little bit. Could run a sneaky egg. Gingerbread man is on tier three. So the lucky cat's just kind of chilling for now. Maybe we do Thunderbird. Get rid of sneaky egg, go Thunderbird. Our pen gobble gets a bunch of mana. Maybe that's the play. Not quite. Um, let's see, get rid of... I guess we get rid of the Bunyip, actually. I actually will level it right now. Yeah, I was hoping we'd get something like that. There's some solid tier 3s out there. The, the Lucky Cat being one of them. So you're gonna be a 4 mana pen gobble. Not bad. Ooh, we did kill his jackalope. That's huge. And we got the mana snipe. Wonderful. That is even more huge. Alright, so now we're going to be doing something more along these lines. We get the Ogopogo Lucky Cat combo. And roll me. I mean, Bunyip, that's a level 2 if we want it. Do we send that? I don't know. Is it better than Thunderbird? Unit wise, no. You could maybe argue the level up is, but... I don't know. Uh, sure... I guess. Okay, this is fine. Does mana always hit the frontmost unit? No. We just got unlucky. <laughs> I feel like it had been recently and I, was, I just wasn't sure if that was a thing. Yeah, we'll take the level. Chimera's solid here. We do this. We're still getting gold from you. We don't have to have the Ogopogo on the team. Hold you. Um, we'd actually like to do it like this. Okay, this seems like we're doing- we're gonna do pretty solid. 
And honestly, double gingerbread man is also very good. I'm a little weary to full send the cat here. Primarily because this also is an economy generator. And if we buy the cat right now, it's going to go away. <laughs> we don't want that. Um, you know, maybe we just want it on here. I don't think we're going to keep the mana hound. Doesn't really play into the, the vibe here. Which actually, rock is definitely up there. Was that six mana? Yeah, that's just better than the mana hound. Okay. And it sets up for a pretty baller next turn. I might upgrade Lucky Cat next turn. A little 12 12. Didn't do a whole lot there. So the jump teams definitely seem like the strongest mid game. Maybe early game too, I'm not sure. Um, give me the level. If we get Kitsune, we win. We did not get Kitsune. We do not win yet. <laughs> Roll me. We do find you. Which means we won't take advantage of the level two. Until we get Kitsune, we can't do the rock pen gobble combo. That's the that's the issue we're running into right now. But the six mana from the Thunderbird on the Chimera just seems too good to pass up. Alternatively, you'd have probably two, two twos, maybe two four fours. See, he knows what's up. He got lucky with the Kitsune. Didn't win, but <laughs> he got the Kitsune. He's just missing the Pen Gobble, that's all. Um... Hold the chocolate. We're looking for the Kitsune first and foremost. And then we can use the chocolate once we find it. There he is. Okay, so that means we get rid of the lucky cat. We do this, we do this, we do this. And then level you. No, we level you. Because that's just better. I guess we throw in the Chimera, because we have a good amount of gold for it. Alright, cool. <laughs> this is... This is going to be a little insane. How much mana are we working with here? Let's find out. Does it do well against a jump team? That's the question. 34? Yeah, I'd reckon two 36, 36s. Probably going to get the job done. <laughs> On turn 9. It's a little ridiculous. Perhaps a little too strong. Maybe. I don't know. Y'all can be the verdict. I think we focus on getting the Chimera leveled. Looks like we can do that and the rock. Ooh. That's fantastic. Next turn we're going absolutely bonkers. We're gonna get to 50 mana pretty soon here. We're already at 43. And then we're going to have a level 3 <laughs> Chimera next turn. So we go here. Definitely want to get the rock cooking as well. I mean, that might just be too much. I don't know. Does the mana go over 50? I've never seen it before. We got three 43 43s. I wish I could build them in shop and get these these kind of stats. <laughs> but I don't think that's going to happen. We also don't have pill in the back, so that's another reason. But I definitely want to try just like a food build and big mana potion kind of play. And then pill level 3 Chimera. That sounds fun. That would be a lot of fun. I'm not really interested in the Thunderbird. I'm looking for a rock. That that works. Okay. So this is definitely gonna be over 50. I'm curious what happens when you get over 50 on the on the mana count. 
Does it just not transfer all the way? Oh, it just goes to 50. Oh, it's capped. Interesting. It'd be kind of nice if it just like passed it along to the next guy and we could put a sea serpent in front of it. <laughs> that would be kind of cool. Perhaps a little too strong, but kind of cool, right? So now we can get rid of the Thunderbird, I think. Just run whoever we feel like. Which I don't know who that's going to be. Who's the next best thing? I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I'm not sure. Maybe we try for a Sea Serpent and we try to just stack up some mana potions. That could be kind of cool. I guess. No Sea Serpents. Alright, well we got the three level threes. Love to see it. This might be too strong. Um, I would venture to say it probably is too strong. Short of having this guy instantly sniped or this guy instantly sniped, it, it's kind of unbeatable. I'm getting like throwbacks, we'll say PTSD flashbacks of sorts to the, the OG unicorn pack days when it first came out. That's kind of the vibe here. And to think this used to be a plus one, plus two mana. <laughs> Is a little too much. Yeah, the pen gobble might need to go. We'll see. We'll see what Team Wood does. I'm curious. Curious to see how they handle this little nonsense team right here.